just heard the fire went out. Went out? You mean it's controlled? No. It's completely out. It extinguished itself. How could that be? Hell if I know. I'm so relieved that Rachel's awake. Dad, I'm glad that you're here. Me too, Rachel. It really hurts. Shh. The pain will pass. Chloe's here. You want me to stay? No. I'll be okay. Thanks, Dad. I'll come back in a little while. My guardian angel. How are you? Not great. Better with you here. Rachel, I'm sorry. What? What for? You're here because of me. Because I choked back there in the junkyard. What? Shut up. You were so fierce and I just, I just froze. God, I fucked it up. And I'm so sorry. And, and you saved my life. You saved my life. I almost lost you. I can't believe I almost- You're not getting rid of me that easy. Good. Happy that your dad's here. I mean... I'm still mad at him. For everything he's done. But... It felt so good to lean on him. He's my dad, you know? I felt completely safe. Like, on Mount Hood. <laughs> Would you do something for me? Anything. Sarah. Mom. <laughs> it's so weird to say. I'm not even sure what she is, honestly. But <laughs> I think I still want to meet her. I figured you would. I don't even know if she's still in Arcadia Bay. But if she is... Will you find her? Please? You really want this. Don't you? I do. Chloe. I really do. Then, of course, whatever it takes. I bet my dad has her number. Maybe in his office. Our house keys just under the mat. The code is 0722. To your... Your dad's office? 0722. Yeah. My birthday. I'll find her, Rachel. And then I'll... 
I'll tell her how fucking cool you are. Thank you, Chloe. For... Everything. Uh, hey, Elliot. Hey! Wait. Your hair, it's... different. <sighs> yeah. Yeah. I like it. It's... uh... It's nice. Sorry I bailed on seeing The Tempest with you. The whole thing just sort of... Happened. Uh, no, not not a problem at all. So, what's going on with you? Uh, I don't even know where to start. At the moment, I'm here for Rachel. What? Rachel's here. What happened? She got stabbed by a psycho. Oh my god. Yeah. It was insane. Holy shit. Wait, are, are you okay? I mean, I'm probably not okay, but I can deal with that later. Are you... Are you two in some kind of trouble? You can tell me if you are, you know. I won't judge. What? I don't even know what you mean. Come on. A random psycho going around stabbing people? For no reason? Well, that's what happened. Chloe! seriously worried about you. Well, don't be. Uh, I mean, you're hanging out with Rachel Amber a lot lately, right? So what? So, obviously something is going on. I swear, man. Everything's really okay. Okay. I trust you. Just remember I'm here, okay? If you suddenly need something. Thanks. Anyway, see you around. Yeah. See you around, Chloe. Hello?
I need to search this office for any communication with Sarah that can help. <laughs> it's the big one. James has a file on Frank. I'd love to read this, but I've got to focus on finding Rachel's mom. Best dad. That stuff is all politics anyway. Hmm. secret key. Now to find the secret lock. Welcome to Shadyville. to know who James is talking to on the secret phone of his. It could be about Sarah. James is working with Damon Merrick? This is insane. What were they talking about? Is the girl Damon's talking about Sarah? Whatever is going on, I need to see if Damon knows where Sarah is. But how do I get him to tell me? say hope James actually has this evidence James sure keeps lots of files on people More sherry. <sighs> Shh. 
Sheldon. Why do I feel like I've heard that name before? Even if James is trying to protect Rachel from her mother, this seems like a pretty terrible way to act. This must be what Damon was talking about. Shit. Which of these is Damon talking about? I... TV has taught me anything, these babies will be swimming in DNA. Could this be the evidence? Damon and Knives seem like a solid bet. If I can figure out how. How do I destroy a glove? Maybe I can burn it somehow. Arcadia Bay's least wanted. that again. I hope James has something here to tell me who Damon's informant is. So I need to find which of Damon's guys has been snitching? I should search around the office to see if there's any info to help me out. Okay, 
There's no way that Frank is snitching on Damon. But I love learning about his badass loitering charge. This is that freak from the mill. Wonder what Damon would think of his very cooperative comment. I agree to aid the courts on future cases. That could be seen as a little snitchy. Sarah sent all these letters, and James never gave them to Rachel? That's so messed up. The Sarah in this letter doesn't seem anything at all like the person James told us about last night. So, this looks like Sarah stopped cashing the checks James sent her. Guess he forgot to mention that during his story last night. Arcadia Bay's least wanted. I agree to aid the courts on future cases. That could be seen as a little snitchy. Okay. If I'm going to accuse one of these guys, I'd better be sh I agree to aid the courts on future cases. That could be seen as a little snitchy. I totally knew this guy was a criminal when I stole from him. This guy let me into the mill. Cool dude. Could this douchebag be the snitch Damon's talking about? Guess this explains why Mr. Amber knows so much about Frank. This is that freak from the mill. Wonder what Damon would think of his very cooperative comment. Okay, 
There's no way that Frank is snitching on Damon. But I love learning about his badass loitering charge. Man, this guy's the snitch. He was so cool to me at the mill. Wonder if there's someone else I could pin it on instead. I guess getting your ass kissed comes with the DA territory. I agree to aid the courts on future cases. That could be seen as a little snitchy. Guess I'm lucky James keeps so much info at home. Pro tip, when digging for secrets, try the DA's computer. Looks like a recent email from Rachel's mother to James. Even if James is trying to protect Rachel- oh, man. This guy's the snitch? He was so cool to me at the mill. Wonder if there's someone else I could pin it on instead. Could this douchebag be the snitch Damon's talking about? Here's hoping James already has Damon's money. <sighs> but where would it be? I wonder if this has anything to do with Damon's stash. Holy shit. Fuck, that's Sarah. And... She's at the mill. What is he doing to her? Holy shit. Does James even know what he's doing? I still have time. Damon's waiting for his money, right? He wouldn't do anything to her. Yet. Fuck. I need to get there fast. Chloe? Elliot? Hey! Elliot, what are you doing here? What are you doing here? This is Rachel's house, right? 
Did you really just follow me here? Did you... Did you follow me from the hospital? I did. I'm worried about you. I'm fine. You're the one acting crazy. You shouldn't be here. Chloe, what is... Ah! Elliot, put that down. You have no idea what you're dealing with. And you do? Chloe, what have you gotten yourself into? You... You wouldn't understand. Give me a chance. What the hell are you doing? I, I can't tell you, but obviously this is pretty serious shit. That's why I need to leave right now. You mean serious for Rachel, right? But, but you're the one putting yourself in danger again. I'm so sick of you not seeing who Rachel really is. When will you realize what she's doing to you? Elliot, just take a step back. No. You need to listen to me. What has your relationship with her gotten you? You... you don't know what you're talking about. First night you hang out, what happens? You end up in a fight. You don't know what you're talking about. Rachel saved my ass. I'm sure that's how it seemed to you. Stop... stop suggesting that she's somehow... Bad. The next day, she convinces you to skip school. Magically, she barely gets in trouble. And you get expelled. <sighs> I took the fall because I wanted to. Rachel tried to protect me. Yet somehow, it all worked out for her in the end, as usual. You don't understand. You weren't there. Was she protecting you when she made you take part in a play you didn't want to be in? She let you make a fool out of yourself. God, oh, look, I I'm sorry I ditched you for the play, but- This isn't about that. S seriously, man, y you need to shut the fuck up before- I've been quiet long enough. Look, Rachel is an amazing actress, and I don't mean on stage, she's fake. You're real, and I hate to see her manipulate you like this. Elliot, I, I promise, n no one is manipulating me. No? Just look where you are now. A high school dropout. Hanging out with criminals and breaking into houses. It's crazy. It just as easily could have been you in that hospital today. If that ever happened. Look, I, I hear you. I, I appreciate the concern. I don't think you do. Elliot. I'm the one who cares about you, Chloe. Me. Not Rachel. It's time you saw the truth. What does that mean? It means you're going to stop thinking about Rachel and pay attention to me now. For once. Elliot, please. I know you're upset. But... I'm not upset! I'm trying to help you. Elliot's gone full-blown crazy. I... I need to get the police to come without tipping him off. Who was there for you? When Max left? When your dad died? No one else gave a shit about you except for me! We have a lot to talk about. And I don't care how long it takes. We're not leaving until you see that I'm right.
All right, Elliot. You want to talk so bad? Let's talk. What's really going on here? You can tell me. You mean here? Specifically? Like, uh, the Amber House? I'm talking about your situation. Rachel is dangerous. You need to realize that. You're the one who's keeping me here. At the Arcadia Bay DA James Amber's house. You're acting strange. What's going on? What? Nothing. I... What are you... Ugh, you bitch! Can't you see? I just want to help you! You're going to assault me now? That's how far you'll go to protect Rachel? This is what I'm talking about. No! You idiot! What the fuck? Better run, dickbag. Cops will be here any minute. <laughs> 